Hey, Orange One here. So I'm playing a game that's pretty different than what I've ever played before. This is actually a browser game. I thought, though, to show this off, I was actually looking into this for work because I wanted to look into AI story generation. And I found this thing. It's pretty amazing. I was just doing cyberpunk. It was pretty amazing. Um, apocalyptic, though, seems to be something that does well on the channel. So I'm going to go with that. Oh, oh man, we could be a courier in the apocalypse. Now we're going to go with um, Survivor. Enter the character's name. Biscuit. All right, Biscuit the Survivor. Let's see. What's your story? I'm not going to read it all out. I'll let you read it out. I'm, I'm not much of a reader. I'm sorry. <laughs> that would be good for this type of video, wouldn't it? <laughs> Okay, we're searching for food. You stairs or elevator? She says stairs. I say that we, that I'm not doing stairs again. Not after last time. I don't know if I need to do like proper grammar or not. I don't think I do. I think it, the AI can figure it out. I say that I am not doing stairs again, not after last time. Now you're seeing that I can't type. <laughs> Let's see what she says. Fine, I'll push you up. Just be careful not to trip on your own feet. And, okay, let's see what happens when we go upstairs. We'll see what they, happens. Climbing down this, are you, you're, I, she's pushing me, up. okay, whatever. I jump on the stair five times. <laughs> See what happens. I start playing my banjo. Let's see what. Okay, something's gonna happen. Because, like, I was doing the cyborg thing and there was, like, all this fighting and stuff. Um, okay, I, um, I don't know what, I'm just gonna let, I think you could also just kind of let it do its thing, and let's see, the wind's blowing directly on you, let's just see what the AI does with this. You hear Hazel yell. Stay up there with the kids. Let's see what happens. Let's see what the AI says. Okay. Um, what is going on? This is like the weirdest story. Okay. Okay, let's see what that happens now. The owner is long dead. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's a tunnel. I grab my barb wire wrapped uh bat since the beginning okay let's see H oh jeez a bunch of marmots up from top I swing my bat. 
Come on, let's get into some combat. Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's see what happens after that. <laughs> oh, that's super creepy. I throw a Molotov cocktail down the tunnel. Let's see what happens. I light a cigarette from the flame. Come on, it's the apocalypse, right? <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. I run into the flaming tunnel. Let's see what happens in the flaming tunnel. I'm just curious. Okay. Um, I keep on running and find a fallout shelter. Let's see what's in the shelter. <laughs> Um, okay. I lock the door behind me. Let's see what happens. Why? Why would I do that? For two years? What? Okay, this is getting a little bit bizarre. I meet them and train them more okay let's let's see what i'm training them for the old man that ran the camp uh yes my ex lover <laughs> Yeah, and I, I heard it's on the radio as well. It's really bad, huh? Wait, how am I talking to him? This is a letter. <laughs> Don't say that without me, you all would be dead. You're right. This is strange for a letter. <laughs> Is it a talking letter? It's these days. <laughs> what? Yeah. He's always been messed up since the big fire. Oh, jeez. Wow. Good thing you got here. 
Now we can send you to the other side. I'm the now an authorized letter carrier. Good to people who need them. Yeah, don't forget their meds as well. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing. Not since the big fire, I don't forget. Oh man. <laughs> Open the door. Okay. It's <laughs> okay. So is this a shelter that I've been before? Oh man. No. Let's stop that and go to the surface. Remember the aliens on the surface? Bad AI, no. <laughs> yeah, wouldn't want to erase those memories. Jeez. I think that we're good. Wipe my memories or not. Okay, I'm at the next town. I give them all of the letters besides the one from the old man to the drag dragon <laughs> yep we're doing it we're going dragon there's a dragon in here like project zomboid <laughs> yeah i am interested to see what the postmaster said I read the letter from the old man to the dragon. Come on, tell me what's in that letter. Oh wait, what? A dragon killing another dragon? I, I just am delivering something to one though. Okay, so we're going into... Okay. Okay. To Rask. Well, Rask is on another planet, so since the warp stops us from traveling above light speed, I don't think that is feasible. <laughs> Let's see what you say. It. Yeah, it's it's way too far. He's in his retirement home. Okay, if I was training people. <laughs> okay. Um, a little boring. Yeah, training mailman is pretty boring. <laughs> oh yeah, the aliens with the big fire. Come on, the big fire. Tell me what happened. Uh, 
I um go under the town. See my warp. <laughs> I go even deeper. I'm just going to see if what happens if we keep on going deeper. Wait, street lights. I go even deeper. <laughs> I want to see what happens. Wait, what? Oh man. Okay. You hear noise and you freeze. I pull out my pistol. I smell them before I see them. Let's see what. They don't notice me. I shoot them both in the head. <laughs> I shoot again at the other one. <clears throat> Let's see what happens. I then <clears throat> give it first aid. Let's see. I um <clears throat> I ask them where they are from. I put more pressure on the wound. Let's see. Does that actually I ask it more questions. It starts to talk to me. Come on, what does it say? Help you with what? I read its mind chip. <laughs> I move over and loot the other one. I eat it all. I, uh, let's see. Check my pistol. Oh, okay. Let's see what it's trying to communicate. Apparently, I can read its mind. I guess I'm not human or something. I can read its thoughts about a laboratory.
Oh, okay, this is interesting. I ask it where the lab is. I heal them and take them with me to the lab. Please take me to the lab. I want to go to the lab, Z. Wait, is, are we taking him back to the lab? No, the military. Oh, okay, they're trying to communicate with me. This is getting interesting. I start to play my banjo. <laughs> I start to hum. Come on, if I don't have my banjo. I hum as we get to the lab. The military attacks us. Let's see, I want to I want to see what happens. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> What's going to happen? Oh, what? Where are the aliens? <laughs> I grab my pistol and shoot them both. Yep, they didn't take my pistol. <laughs> I get on the alien ship with a lot of Molotovs. Come on, finale. <laughs> yep, it was too perfect. <laughs> okay. The alien ship follows. Come on. I keep on running and shooting my pistol. Okay, I'm collapsing to the ground again. <clears throat> Insect-like accent. I'm innocent until proven guilty. <laughs> Firing the pistol into the air, that's that's not it doesn't really go with that. They charge at me. Oh jeez, I'm dead apparently. The The alien 
ship scans my brain and uploads me into a cyborg body. Right? Come on. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. I grab my pistol. <laughs> oh, man. Apparently, that didn't work. I then uh I then call on the radio for reinforcements. Yep, I guess as a robot, I still have access to a radio. Oh man. Intense. Oh man. Jeez. That's that's pretty intense. Um I call on the radio again. I try again. No answer, man. I then start. I then ask the aliens if they want to play a game of poker. I win and get all of their rations and water. I <laughs> forgot okay. I still beat them in poker. <laughs> We all grab our pistols. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, the children. Can't read the mail that way, I guess. Oh, geez, amazing and inclusive. Yeah, I mean, it has to be inclusive to be accepting us after this story. Jeez, this is like the most insane AI story ever. So I go to location unknown obviously that's obviously what happens <laughs> how disappointing oh wait what Nice. Okay. Um, what do I see in front of me? 
<laughs> a bouncy castle. <laughs> I jump on the bouncy castle. <laughs> Okay, this is just the most insane thing ever. I remember my mission. Which is what again? <laughs> I think we gotta end this soon, this is going on too long. Is it the old man? Their plan is worth a fortune. Too bad. It is so far away. <laughs> what? I use my mind flames to save the day, of course. Oh my gosh. Happily ever after. Let's see what happens if we say that. Okay. <laughs> into space, I wander up into space. What will you do with your free time? Play video games. Perfect. Okay, I'm gonna end on that note. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One. Oh man, insanity. <laughs>